Hi friends, uh, welcome back to my channel. In the previous video, we saw how to integrate uh, AD services uh, into 40 gauge firewall. In this video, we will see, you know, how to use the users defined under the user group to authenticate, uh, I mean, to use the 40 gauge firewall, to log into the 40 gauge firewall. So we'll make use of uh, the user group that is defined under uh, the domain that we created earlier and we are going to you know allow those users to log into the 48 firewall and uh, after that we'll try to you know create a policy with the with some restrictions based on ad uh, users all right guys um let me just show you quickly what i have done here if you go to user and computer, well, under the domain, you will see I have created a group, Ariaka01. And under this group, I have members defined, admin, test1, test2, all those. So now I'm going to integrate, I'm going to allow all these users to log into the 48 device. As you know that I have already integrated the AD services. The 48 firewall is already in the domain. let me just quickly show you the configuration what we have done till now so the dns server is still the same and my ldap configuration is still the same i'm going to rebind this as you can see All right, everything is working properly. So now we will go ahead with the creating the profile and we will call these uh, user group in the profile and we'll allow the access, the firewall access. So now, first of all, we'll create a group. I will call it as uh, AD group I'm going to call this Under system administrator, I'm going to create a profile for the AD users. And I'm going to give them read write access.
I'm going to call this profile and I'm going to use this group, AD group, which I created in the previous step. That's it, guys. So now I have my user profile called in to this administrator profile. So I should be able to log in with the credentials, with the user credentials that I have defined under the domain. First of all, I will check with the test one. Let's see how it works out. Okay, this one is working fine. As you can see, I'm using AD user database to log into uh, the 40 gate firewall let's check one more credential this time we will try with test two all right you can see all the credentials, all the users under the user group are able to log into the firewall with the read write access. So now you can see I have called in the AD group and only those users will be able to access any resources through the firewall. All right, guys, we have created a policy here to allow the traffic from the source any and the user in this user group to have access to the internet. So here you can see I belong to the user group and I'm able to, you know, go to the Google services. All right, guys, that's all for today's um, class. I hope you liked my video. Please do subscribe to my channel if you really like the content and stay tuned for more updates. Have a good day.